I'm just using it to check the, like the lighting because before I tried it and my skin was like really dark. What's up you guys, Sick from Miller here and today I'm going to be doing like a, I don't want to say a review but just a what's on my iPhone since it's been two months since I've got my phone and just a little update on how it's been for me and so far I'm really enjoying it. I had a little few things like how I mentioned in the video before when I first got it, still battery life is, it's getting a little used to it, still love the camera a lot. And yeah, so starting off, so right now I'm on my main screen, so here I just have my FaceTime, maps, weather, and notes on the first page. I just like to keep a, I don't know, clean so I can see my background, as well as on the bottom I have my Google Play Music, I have my internet, and my messages. And to the next page, I have what we call Google, oh, my bad. Google, so that folder. All right, in that folder I have my Gmail, my Google Maps, Photos, Drive, and Music, which I don't use the iTunes Music, I use mainly the Google. And on the right of it, I just have my utilities, so just shit that I don't use, that I'm that pointless kind of in a way. So I got my voice memos, compass, measure, iTunes store, home, TV, and health and wallet, so I don't use any of this, so I just tuck it away. And another folder one for final iPhone files, watch, and reminders. So, yeah. And then on top right, I have my Verizon app. So, where I have my phone from, from calculator, calendar, clock, camera, my contacts, phone, app source, photos, settings, and my YouTube. Social media, I got Facebook, Messenger, Instagram, my Snapchat, and yeah, Tinder. Because, oh, your boys. Your boy's been out of the game for a while, so, <laughs> so I'm gonna try and. Uh, your boy's been out of the game for a while, so he's gonna try and get back into the game, you know, go into the flow of things. <laughs> uh, yeah, so. Anyways, <laughs> then I have my games. Uh, I got PUBG Mobile uh, Choices, so on that, it's like. I don't know if you guys know what that is. Choices is a. Uh, as it is, it says choices and for loads. Kind of. Go through the little story modes, you make choices, and choose kind of like a butterfly effect kind of a game, but um, I really enjoy it. Then I have one called Poly Spear, so on that one, it's I like to do this one. I'm just on my you know, board or whatever, I'm saying, Oh, okay. Oh, well, sweet, I got new ones. Anyway, so let me just show you what it, what it is. Consist of real quick. Stop moving. Are you done? No. So like here for an example, it's just, just weird shapes and colors. You just like move it around and try to find the actual image. So I'm not too sure what it is, but anyways, it kind of gets to the brain thinking really well. And I don't know, it's just it's just something to keep you busy. So so you make images like this of tiger, snake, snail, or car, piggy bank, etc. So then I have another game called Limbo. That one, it's kind of like a touch. Oh, it's kind of weird. It's just trying to get out of the hell and trying to save your sister. It's just like a real thinking game. But I don't play too much of it anymore. Yeah, then on the very bottom, I have my Stars app and my HBO, so just when I'm bored or whatever, pull up the movie and just watch it. So right now I'm actually so on HBO. I'm currently watching where is it? Uh, Jupiter Ascending, so I stopped that a while ago and on the stars. I haven't really started anything for the stars. So if it loads. <laughs> yeah, I was watching Dear John. Yeah. So, it was one of those days, it was raining, so whatever, don't, don't judge me, don't. <laughs> then over here I have my banking, so my Wells Fargo, my, my new Fed, my insurance for Geico and Venmo, so when I have to send money to other people anyways. 
then I have my camera app where I have my GoPro, Lightroom, so where I edit a lot of my my oops, so a lot of my photos. So here's one, another. So that's what I use mainly use that one for Lightroom and Light. This one's sort of like an sort of like Lightroom, but this one I get to do a little bit more than I would usually do. So. Yeah. So Lightroom, I usually mainly use that for color grading, for, and then Rush. This is like my on-the-go uh, Premiere Pro, sort of, sort of like a dumbed-down version. So kind of like the a basics rundown of what I mainly use on my laptop, which is Premiere Pro. Create a new one. We'll go to Add Media, to Camera Roll. So just. See, I don't have that many stuff, so let's say this creates. So I'm, I was on a machine gun course, so let's put it in there. It's like a little editing. You can put titles in there, different type of transitions. I can color grade how I want it, so put presets on there. I can mess with the audio, put music in, transform it, so like here, move it over, vertical type of Kind of like a little, real basic type of thing, real simple. Keep it busy if I want to. Then I have one called Fix the Loop. So this is kind of weird in a way. So, so like right here. So right here, I'll just show you. So if I play it, see the sky is how it's moving, and the waterfall, and then you got the little river down here is flowing. So that's what I get to do with this one. Or this app. Then I have my travel app, so which is. My bird, bird app. So it's, you ever seen those electric scooters that are usually around? So currently there's none around in my area, but I like to use that. I run by the beach. Razor is another one for that. Then Airbnb because every so every other weekend or so I'll go somewhere and I really don't feel like paying for a hotel, so that's why I'll go I'm here try to rent a room for someone. Then I got my two dashers fleet. So. Dasher is because oh, sometimes I'll do a DoorDash and I'll work for them, so that's the app that I use so I can get notified to go places or deliver food as well as the Fleet Fleet app. That's more for Postmates, so kind of the same thing, but just two different companies. So I do those a little on the weekend. Then I got my mailbox, my Bitmoji, and my YouTube Studio. So that's where I go. How many people have seen my videos? Who commented? Thumbs up, and I can see. Where you guys commented, I can reply there, so that's why I do that for Audible. So when I'm driving around, I'll just, especially long road trips, I'll listen to these. So these are the main books I've been listening to. So Passion and Torments. So I'm a huge Lauren Cake fan, and I love her books, The Fallen series. So that's why I listen to those when I travel and have my safari. App. That's pretty much it. So yeah, so. Two months with it, I'm um, really enjoying it, especially how I can just share my photos with my laptop, make things a whole lot easier. And other than that, enjoy, love the size, still hate the battery, but other than that, I'm just, it's just simplistic. It's kind of, I don't know, it's too simple, simple for me, but I'm enjoying it a lot more and more, so who knows, maybe I'll stay with iOS or I might go back to Android, but still, it's, a little, it's only had it for two months. So, still don't tell. But other than that, so that's all I have for you guys today. Remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, I will see you guys later. Peace.